Hi folks, welcome to uh, built-in obsolescence. So what I want to do here is just clarify a few things for the viewers here on uh, what we're talking about when we refer to things as uh, having planned obsolescence or built-in obsolescence. I want you to really think about having really good examples of, you know, concrete examples of products that uh, illustrate planned obsolescence or built-in obsolescence. First thing to note, built-in obsolescence means that the designer has intentionally built in obsolescence into the product. What does that mean? It means, for example, here, here I have a, uh, one of my throwaway disposable shavers. So I shave with this in the morning, I use it once, and I throw it away. Now, I go through a ton of those, and to be honest, I've, uh, I've shifted to uh, a uh, rather expensive uh, electric shaver just to save money on these things, because you know, throwing that into landfill is not a very good idea. Um, another thing, here we have a biro pen. When these guys, uh, well, when the ink runs out of this, what do we do with it? We throw it away, we go to the news agent, we buy another one. Not very good, but the idea is that we keep on going back and buying them. It's, that keeps that, that, uh, that uh, what do you call it, money stream flooding in. All right, here's an Apple product, the iPad. Um, why does this have built-in obsolescence? Well, this is iPad 2. What are we up to now? iPad, the new iPad, so there's been three iPads in a very short space of time. Why? Well, because I, Apple want you to keep on buying their products. They add new features, better camera, uh, better processor, better battery life. But in particular, um, Apple, with their products, whether you've got an iPhone, iPod, iPad, one of the things you'll notice is that you cannot take the battery out very easily. They've designed it so it's all integrated. So at the end of its life, even before the end of its life, when you... Uh, when a new product gets released onto the market, you see that, you fall in love with it, you want its new features, and off you go down to the Apple Store and buy a new product. So all of these products have built-in obsolescence. They have been intentionally designed that way by the, um, the designer, really as a way just to ensure that uh, there's always money coming back into the business, coming back into the, uh, the cycle for you to buy new products. Okay, built-in obsolescence.